I think a lot of kids in life are said, oh, you're tone deaf, you can't sing, or, you know, you suck, you draw stick people. Like, I know an artist by the name of Stick Man. I mean, art's, art's in my soul, you know, since I was born, always drawing, doing stuff. But music was really where I kind of started. Uh, I was in ska bands in the 90s, and we had to make album covers, so I started making our album covers, our logos. Started doing stuff for other bands and rave flyers, and got really good with Photoshop and Illustrator, and started getting job at agencies. So a lot of the chops I got was just doing, you know, doing it. The, the idea of creating art or creating art is a, for a living, like, that's, that's, I mean, doesn't get much better than that, I'll be honest with you, so. What brought me here was, we had a little baby in Chicago, and uh, that changed my life, honestly. Kids, kids are a motivation, you know, they're a motivation for you to do. The reason I put up beautiful art is to make this place a better place for them. You know, it kind of makes the world go around, I guess. I tried to, to live in Chicago, uh, still do the agency stuff, but I wanted to buy a house. And what a perfect place, St. Louis. And around that same time, I really kind of stepped away from the commercial art world and got into doing like flash animation um, and web design. So at that time, I was like, okay, I still have this need to create illustrations, do drawings. And then I saw stencils and found this new medium that I seriously, like, lost, lost it. I mean, I loved it. I was like, stencil, stencil, spray paint. Basically, the beauty of a stencil is I can spray it on a piece of wood, on a canvas, but once that stencil's made, as long as it's a flat surface, pull it off. So I'll do multiple layers to kind of create this image. About six months after I started stenciling, there was a website based out of Melbourne, Australia, and the website was called Stencil Revolution. Stencil artists from all around the globe could post their art. So I started posting art to there, made relationships with these people. When they came to the States, they'd, I'd say, come to St. Louis, we got walls, they'd give me paintings, we'd trade paintings. And I was like, wow, I'm in St. Louis. You know, I'm meeting more people in this world than I ever did in Chicago or New York or anything. And it's like, and I'm living, I'm being an artist. I think a lot of people don't get the difference between beautification and vandalism. Like there's a lot of people out there wrecking buildings, you know, and sometimes I'll get put into that mold. You know, there's a difference between artists and artists, you know, people who are doing this because they love. The whole reason I do these eyes is because I'm trying to open up other eyes. I used to go by Stensoul, and I still kind of go by Stensoul, but my alias was S-T-E-N-S-O-U-L, because I believe eyes are the window to the soul. And all these portraits I were doing, you know, anywhere you look, he's looking at you, and I would always kind of do it this front forward eye thing. I don't know, there's something about eyes, and, and talking to people, you know, talking to you like this, or talking to you like, like that, you know, like looking deep into people's eyes. I mean, I believe we all have souls. You may or may not, but I believe there's something in all of us. And if you're willing to make that connection, I mean, there's nothing stronger than that. Places like St. Louis are amazing for artists. I mean, honestly, I feel like I'm in the perfect spot right now. Like I could not do what I'm doing anywhere else and live the way. I mean, this studio is amazing. I couldn't get this studio in any other city I mean, I'm very passionate, but I'm very passionate about the city, and I feel that there is so much potential for this being, I mean, the next place. The next place to do it all. We're right in the middle of the country. Tap, 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 tap. Got two more. My messy desk. All right, done.